So, you're the new body, huh? He seriously has to stop doing this to people. Um, well, it's my job to examine you, but first off, I mean, I don't really know if you're dead or not, that's the thing, because he really wants me to make sure that you're dead before I cremate you, so, yeah, we're just gonna be running a few tests on you, if you can hear me. I'm sorry, the next couple of steps might hurt, so... First off, I don't want to get any of your um, germs on me if you actually are dead, so I'm just going to be cleansing your face with these alcoholic pads, okay? Mm -hmm. Let me just take one out. Okay. Now just stay still for me. I'm just going to take this. I'm just going to... And wipe everything away and I think that's pretty good okay now that I cleansed your face for your germs I'm just going to be marking your face okay because I need to know some things before I get into this exam so just stay still for me I'm just gonna be marking over there over here, on your nose bridge, in the center of your forehead, on your chin, and on the tip of your nose. I'm just going to lift your chin a bit and put it on your neck. And I think we're done. Okay. Now that we did that, the first exam we're going to do is relatively painless. Um, I'm just going to be pulling down your eyelid and I'm going to be shining this light on you and looking through it to see um, some stuff that I have to see, okay? Alright. Usually most people actually get caught if they're faking dead at this step, but um, props to you if you don't. So, first off, I'm just going to be taking this and I'm going to be pulling down your eye. Down. I'm just gonna look through that. Hmm, seemed pretty dead to me. Okay, now that I did that, I'm gonna be taking the other eye. I'm just gonna pull it down again. All right, I'm just gonna be looking. Okay, mm -hmm. your eyes look pretty dead. That's a good sign. Okay, now that I did that, I'm gonna go on with a touch test, okay? Just tell me if you feel it or not, okay? I just gotta, I'm just gonna look at your reactions to see if you're dead or not by me poking around, okay? So. Okay. You seem pretty dead. Okay, no reaction at all because I literally just poked your eye. Um, all right. And now for the harder step. I'm just going to open your mouth. Good job. And I'm going to be pulling a tooth out, okay? It's going to be really painful if you're, like, alive. It doesn't really matter if you're alive or not because, I mean, I have to get the job done anyway, okay? So just open your mouth. I'm just going to take a tooth. There we go. I'm gonna put it over here. Um, no reaction. You have to be because that was really painful. I took out a tooth. But now that I did that, I'm gonna go straight to the smell test. I'm gonna be um, putting some tubes um, underneath your nose so you can smell some things and you just have to tell me what you smell. Mostly I'm gonna see your reactions again because these are some pretty strong smells. So. The first smell. This one. Just tell me what you smell. Mm hmm. Silence. That's a good sign. This was gasoline. Okay. Now, for the second one. Okay. 
Now smell this. Mm -hmm. Exactly, yeah, I know. It's super painful. It's just straight up poison. Mm -hmm. No reaction so far. Very good. Now the next one. Gonna be making this up. Let's smell this. I actually got the sample from the last, I guess, victim that um, he brought me. It's rotten blood and flesh. Mm -hmm. Well, no reaction so far. All right. Then the last one that I have is pretty pleasant, I think. Um, so it's gonna be pretty pleasant, okay? So smell that. Perfume, exactly, I know. Okay, so now that we did that, I'm gonna be doing a taste test, okay? For the taste test, I'm just gonna be taking this little thing, I'm gonna swab it down on the samples and I'm gonna be putting it on your tongue and you just have to um, tell me what you taste and I'm gonna see your reactions, okay? Okay, so first off, let me just take some. Okay, open your mouth. What does that taste like? Acid? It is. <laughs> okay. Now the second one. What does that taste like? Mm -hmm. You're right. Okay. This is going to be a pleasant one, okay? What does that taste like? It's my leftover chocolate. Okay, now lastly. Your mouth. What does that taste like? Alcohol. You're right. Because it does take me a couple shots to complete this job. It's very draining. It's hard work. Now that I did that, I'm just going to ask you to follow my instructions, okay? So, just follow this pen, okay? You see this pen? Follow it, alright? Swallow it. Okay. Your eyes are not moving. Very good. Follow it. Very good. You seem really dead. Okay, so now let's see what other tests I have pretty good here. Okay, so for the final step of my examination, I'm gonna be putting this shot into you. Um, this is just to make sure because um, never happened before, but if you're actually playing dead and you've come this far, I have to cremate you anyway, so I'd rather just, you know, let you go out the easy way. It's been painful up until now, I know, but you know, I think this is a very peaceful way to die. You're putting this shot on your head and on your chest, okay? Where your heart is. All right. So I'm just gonna place it right on the dot that I made. And there we go. All right. And now for your chest, I'm just gonna All right, very good. Okay. Now you have to be dead. Okay, I'm just gonna mark your forehead with a number so that cremation guys know that you're done and ready. I'm just gonna... And there we go. All right, well, um, it was nice seeing you for, I, I think, like 10 minutes. Um, see you in the next life, okay?